Let me get out of here. Is it, an, is it a frustration and an irritation to deal with fair weather, two faced people? Is it, it? Does it make you? Does it just eat your lunch? Does it drive you crazy that 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 they would say one thing, but they would do another? They're not really supporting you, but they pay lip service to you. Or is anyone out there with me on this one? I don't get it. I'm sitting in my bed. I'm thinking about all the things that I'm 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 interested in. I want to, I share it with my friends, I share it with my family, I share it with the world, and it's met with indifference. Or I don't see some of the some of the people you know uh, uh, coming forward as friends and family. I always say they love me, and they all say they they care for me. Not all of them do, but the point is is the fact that. Don't you just get sick and tired of people who say they're your friends but don't do the things that friends do? They want to, they say they support you but then don't support you when you need them the most? This is driving me crazy. That the fact that now I have these friends that, for the most part, they're just there in figurehead. You know, they want to be on a Facebook so they can, I guess, occupy their time so they can feel as though they're contributing to my livelihood or things of that nature. But you know what? Here's the deal. I don't like fair weather friends. I don't like two-faced people who say one thing and then they do another. Or when you expect them to do certain things as friends, as family, you would hope that they follow through. It's not a, it really is. It means integrity, character. I like the idea of being able to live up to my word. When I say I'm your friend, I'm your friend. When I say I'm going to be there for you, I'm going to be there for you. If I can, I definitely will let you know, but I would do the best I can. But this fair weather, fr it's this, and oftentimes I think it's really is just, it's they say something is in water. There's a pollution of, 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 of sorts. And I don't know what's going on, but here's the deal. You know, this, the generation that we're in, you know, it, it seems like the old heads have, have, have latched on to the, this generation of detached people, of indifference. They don't feel anything. They don't, they're selfish. They're, they're selfish, they're self-centered, they're self-serving. You know, that's what drives me crazy. I don't understand how they have walls of friends. You know, and, and it's just been really, by mere words. That's all. Mere words. They don't mean anything. You can't get them to follow through. You can't get them to support anything. You can't get them to do anything that means any good to any human being other than feeding their mouth, listen to crap music, look at that crap TV, Kardash Kardashians? Are you serious? Forty million dollars. Well, who supported that? They're the same fair weather friends, unfortunately, and some of the family members that that uh, that only see they can't see past the nose. Be the best friend you could possibly be, but making sure it's authentic, it's genuine, it's sincere, and when people are hurting, when people are a lady, a lady with 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 wonderful dreams and trips and and. And, 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 and visions and things of that nature, get behind them and support them, okay? Really do. And then the other thing is the fact that, well, when you say you're somebody's friend, you know, please mean it in your heart. Really is. Say it to them often and make sure that, they, that the actions follow the words. I'm out of here.